How you doing? It's Brian from Honeywell Homes. I'm here with my colleague, Chris Parks, and today we're here to talk to you about hydronic zone panels. Chris, what do we got? Brian, we've got a new product lineup that we rolled out uh, just about six, eight months ago. Um, we have made a simplified hydronic zoning panel. So this is essentially the heart of the control system for a hydronic heating. Uh, we have got both zone valve controls as well as pump relays. So yeah. depending on if you prefer to zone with valves or zone with pumps, we've got a relay for you. Uh, what we've done is a very easy to read LED display. We've got different colors in there so you can identify right off the bat if it's a thermostat calling for heat and if the pump or valve is running or should be running. Uh, we've also got notification here through LEDs to let you know if you're in domestic water priority mode or if the boiler should be calling for heat. So you can pretty much walk up immediately to a job site and figure out exactly what's going on or exactly what should be going on in the heating system. Looks like uh, it's easy to get off the cover. It is. Uh, one of the things that we've done is we've made it very easy. A simple car key can come in and unlock the top of the panel. So no more fiddling around trying to find the right screwdriver or drill to get that off of there. It's a little hinge design and comes off. And then what we've done is we've color coded this thing so that there's really no guessing as far as what hooks up to what. So we've got the proper colors for terminal designations for thermostats. We've got everything color coded to fit our zone valves, so no more mixing up the end switch and the motor when you wire it up. Um, plus, the other thing that we've done is we've made it very easy to mount, and you can use power stealing thermostats with ours. So there's no more fishing around trying to hook up resistors or hoping that somebody down the road changes them out and calls you back because now their board doesn't work. So uh, makes it really, really easy. Now the other thing that we've done is on our pump panels because there's not a lot of room down here in our zone valve control because you're just hooking up 18 gauge wire. Mm -hmm. But when you start talking about a pump panel, that 12 and 14 gauge wire can be very difficult to maneuver and fit into a tight space. So on our pump panel, what we've done is we've actually added about another inch and a half of clearance across the bottom okay. to give you guys a lot more room to hook this stuff up. Chris, not that I'm looking, but it looks like you have a big transformer there. We do, we've got full 40 VA transformers on here. Uh, we, we went a little larger on the transformers just uh, compared with our existing controls mainly so that we can handle all the Wi-Fi connected stats, uh, power hungry displays, uh, et cetera. So we're, we're seeing the migration to more and more connected homes. This panel can handle just about anything you throw at it. And we're not using pop rivets, it looks like we can unscrew that. You can unscrew this. I have blown a few transformers in my day. Uh, it's always a bad feeling. With ours, you've got the ability to take this completely apart. You've got wires loose here that in case you let the smoke out of the transformer, you can basically take one off your truck, screw it next to it, and wire it right back in here and get going. And along with that, we got some replacement fuses inside that panel? We do. Um, I remember when I learned how to wire controls, <laughs> I've gone through just about everything. So we, we give you two extra fuses. These are fuse protected transformers. So in case you do pop one or in case you blow the transformer, we've got the ability to get you going without having to make another run down to the supply house. Thanks a lot, Chris. Anything else we need to point out on this? Um, no, that's pretty much it. Um, very easy to set up and install. Uh, we also make a single zone switching relay. Uh, the nice thing with this is, again, a, a single key will open it up. But this is very unique because it's universal. Uh, it gives you a thermostat call and you can use this for just about anything. So we've got an RW and C across the top, so you can use it with a Wi-Fi thermostat. Uh, and it gives you two relays on the bottom. So you could use it to power a pump and something else, uh, which that could be turning a boiler on. We've seen it in applications for uh, fan coil units where it's engaging a blower motor. So a lot of different options when using this product here. Awesome, thanks a lot, Chris. If you run into any occasional jobs where you need to do more than a traditional six zones, you need to go up to 10 zones or more, Chris has some diagrams that are available for you. You can find information about that and any other products at jacksonsystems.com.